Coogan Cassius Fry from London. We're at my gym here in Finchley, North London. With me, I've got cruiserweight boxer Wadi Camacho. What's happening, Wadi? How you doing, Coogan, man? All good, man. You're all good? Training hard, training hard. Just seen uh, a little bit of your session with your new coach, Don Charles. Just talk to me a little bit about your decision to join Don, uh, Don Charles. King, he's King, King Don Charles, yeah. But um, yeah, the decision was, uh, you know, I just needed something fresh and something new, you know, like, no offence, obviously, Brian, Brian done a good thing. But, you know, I just needed a new, new change in the night, you know. I needed um, a couple of different stuff in the night to, to work on and obviously I knew King Don Charles can, can de deliver that. Um, did you take the decision straight after the China Clark defeat? Was it a decision made as a result of the defeat? No, definitely not. Um, it's a decision that um, I had it in like a couple of months, you know, but I was just, um, just riding it, really. But, um, you know, with me, I'm a person that once I've got something in my mind and... You know, finally, I'm not really sort of happy. Then, you know, either way, I would have still made a decision if I would have had my English title around my waist. Um, it's been a, a few weeks since, obviously, your defeat to China Clark. Um, you know, have you got over that now? Yeah, definitely. You know, it's just, me personally, it was just a little error, um, error that I've made. You know, going into going into the ring. Um, you know. I wasn't myself, just um, I just wanted to, you know, probably show the, the crazy match on that and not box as I normally do. But um, this time out now, that's in, that's in the past. I'm looking forward now, you know, I've got the prize fight, 18th of May. And, you know, I'm going to be showing everyone, you know, that I'm a boxer, you know. Not, it's not all about big bombs away or the macho man. You know, I'm here to show my class and just box. And that's what I'm going to be showing. That's what I was about to come on to, 18th of May, your call, uh, Bethnal Green, prize fighter, the cruiserweights. Um, Harry Miles is in it, so you'll be reunited with him. Shane McPhilburn, so I think a few of the other guys haven't been announced yet officially. But um, how come you decided to take this, uh, going to the prize fighter rather? Either, like with me, I always wanted to do the, the prize fight. Like I, ideally, I wouldn't have obviously gone into the prize fight because I would have won the English title and I would have been facing um, uh, what was it, Matt yeah, asking, yeah. Matt asking, um, on this Saturday coming. But um, you know, it's just one thing. I'm still active. You know, I'm very fit, and just want to show everyone, the whole public, the world, you know, that I am a, a class boxer, and everyone's going to see that on the night. Um, what are you hoping that that uh, obviously winning prize fighter can actually launch you? Because you, I said you're very early on into your career anyway, aren't you? So mm -hmm. what are you hoping to accomplish as a result of winning prize fighter? Like Eddie Earn said, you know, um, he goes, Waddy, um, I chuck you in a prize fighter. You know, ideally you're only one, way, one, one fight away from a British title. So ideally it's all about, you know, um, the bigger the, the bigger names in that bill is going to be more better for me. So, you know, just take the people out of the way and just move on but basically but um, you know I'm, I'm not gonna look forward, um, forward to too much now I'm just gonna concentrate on the price fire and then um, you know bigger and better things will come after. Are you gonna look to change your macho girls after your defeat as well they might have been a bad omen? No, no not that you know that that's me you know but you know on, on the price fire it's me you know I'm just gonna go in there train hard you know, as everyone knows, no one see me. You know, I've been training really hard. I, I want to show people that you know I, I'm not out show um, clubbing or promoting this and that. You know, all my friends are all doing all that stuff. I'm just down in the gym seven days a week now, just training really hard, great sparring, and you know I can't get better than that. All right. Well, listen, Roddy. Thank you very much for talking to Wife from London. We we'll look forward to uh, May the 18th at your call. We'll we'll be there, me and James. So. Yeah, wish you the best of luck, but I'm sure we'll catch up with you before then anyway. Yeah, it's a pleasure, man. Pleasure to talk to you. So, no, I ain't seen you since my last fight. And, um, you know, I'm just going to be bring, bringing Wadi back, you know. Like, I'm very happy now, you know. Like, you know, I don't have to think about, oh, I need to do extra this, extra that. King Don Charles can, does all the work for me. And I just show him, you know, what, what I'm capable of doing. So, so, just one final question: Do you f feel like you've focused on other aspects outside of boxing a little bit more than maybe you should have? Like I said, promoting yourself and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera? Um, uh, probably a little bit, but you know, that's just—I think that's just me anyway. Do you know what I mean? But it's just like I'll still probably just still keep continue to keep doing that. But it's only like my mind frame and I of coming out into that last fight. You know, wasn't right. I was angry and. You know, it's like what a crazy person is first round going and not even boxing out. Just, but like I said, it's in the past. I'm looking forward. You know, that was that time, 
and now I'm a new me and new Waddy, not the macho man, but new Waddy, and everyone's going to see. Quick opinion on Trina Clark and Matty Askin? Um, I don't know. Um, might be probably Matt asking out because it might be a little bit more faster, but um, I don't really know. Uh, I mean, it's like let them two, whoever wins out that, I mean, their time will come and I'm going to come for them after, so it's not a problem. So you like do what you need to do and I'll do me. All right, no problem. Uh, this is Kogan Cassius here at my gym in Finchley with Wadi Camacho. Thank you very much.